Welcome to Play In School TV, episode 41. I'm Rich Prado. Today we're heading to campus to talk about recruiting calendars with my staff. You guys ready? Let's go. Like I said, I'm here on campus to talk about the changes in the recruiting calendar for this coming winter. Did you even know that there were changes? Do you know how those changes are gonna affect you this winter? All right, so here's what I wanna do real quick. I wanna chat about the way things used to be. I wanna talk about the changes that the NCAA has made and how that can impact what your plans are for the winter. Okay, so let's talk about the history of this thing for a little bit. So, what has become known as the mega camps within the college baseball industry is really nothing more than what a private business hires college coaches to come out and work their camp. So the mega camps are actually really positive in a variety of ways. So for the college coaches, the reason these big mega camps, as they're called, are, are so important is for three main reasons. First of all, for these young coaches, they get to earn a paycheck, which is always a nice thing. Secondly, they get to see players, okay? So they're getting paid to watch prospects. That's awesome. And then third, it gives coaches an opportunity to network with their peers, potentially meet somebody who's gonna open up a door for them in the future. That's a really good thing. Now, on the side of the players, the mega camps, as they're called, had also a bunch of positive aspects to it as well, okay? Mostly, they get the opportunity to learn from really good coaches. And then secondly, I mean, a big reason why they're there is so they can be seen by these college coaches, right? So let's talk about how this calendar change is gonna impact players this winter. All right, so first, here's the change that's actually taken place. Is the, starting on November 7th will be the dead period. The dead period will last the week of November 7th, and then beginning immediately following that, the quiet period is gonna begin. So you got quiet periods, you got dead periods, what does all that mean? I'll link to the NCAA website with the description of what those uh, definitions are. But uh, basically what that means is the Division I college coaches will not be able to work events off of their own campus. Now the NCAA's goal, remember, in my opinion, was to try to move camps back on campus. Well, the end result is that basically that you're gonna be able to get in front of one or two different coaches at a time, but you're not gonna be able to get in front of 40, 50, uh, college coaches at a time like you were for the last several years at the mega camps Let's talk turkey. What what is the point of all this and what does it mean? And how's this gonna affect the player over the course of the 2016 2017 season? Okay, so the opportunity the ability to easily get in front of more than just a couple of coaches has suddenly disappeared thanks to the NCAA Okay, so how do we remedy this? Very simple, guys. Remember, my business is called Playing School College Recruiting Videos. Video is gonna be super important over the 2016, 2017 um, quiet and dead period. Again, from November 7th to February 28th, coaches are essentially off the road. Well, guess what happens around Valentine's Day? College baseball season starts, which ties them up, okay? So, guys, I can't emphasize right now over the winter time, the college coaches are, are gonna be as free as they are all year. This is gonna be the most office time they've ever had. Having a rock solid, updated, quality college recruiting video is gonna be your ticket to get in front of college coaches' eyes, okay? If you don't have updated, rock-solid video, what I want you to do is call me 
if you're a coach and you run a, uh, an organization or a team, I want you to call me. The price per player for video is substantially less than what your players have been used to paying for the mega camps. Now those mega camps were awesome because they could literally put you in front of 50 uh, coaches. Yeah, but what about video? Video can get you in front of every single coach and get you in front of the right coaches with a simple text message, a simple email. Remember, video works uh, really well on every platform out there. Um, so I want you, if you used to run a mega camp, give me a call. Let's set up a filming camp. If you have a team or organization, give me a call so we can get updated, rock solid, professional quality recruiting videos so these players don't get out of mind and out of sight for the next several months. Because as soon as high school and college season starts, it is very tough to get seen by college coaches. Again, that's where video is going to help you. So the alternative is starting November 7th until about June 1st, the majority of your players will not get seen because of the hectic schedule starting up about Valentine's Day. Guys, I can't stress this enough. It's as simple as sending a text message. It's as simple as sending an email. If you go over to my teams page at playinschool.com slash teams, you're gonna see just how easy it is for a college coach to see you. So guys, these dates can have a big time negative impact or it can create a big time opportunity for players with video. So again, give me a call. Love to hear your thoughts. Hit me up over at Twitter at Play in School or give me a comment below this video. Come on guys, let's go home.